So I was playing around with this massive LLM. Fine tuning done, everything looked good, and I thought, cool, let's deploy it. But the moment I hit run, my laptop just gave up. No GPU, VRAM completely maxed out, and Docker? It literally turned my room into a mini furnace. So yeah, I did what any of us would do. Jumped on the web and started looking for a solution. Found plenty of options, but most were either too pricey, too complex, or just not worth it. And then I found something that actually made sense. Novita AI. You just give it a Docker image, choose your GPU, and you're good to go. All right, let me show you how it works. Here's the Novita AI console. From here, you can access different LLM models, pick your GPU setup, and even launch serverless GPUs. And yeah, you'll see live cost estimates too, which is pretty handy. So for now, we're going to deploy an LLM using their GPU. Just head to the Explore section, and here you'll see some default models already selected. You can either go with a pre-built template or create your own from scratch. Let's try the pre-built one first. Go to the Templates library, pick a template, and click Deploy. Now it'll take you to the GPU selection screen. There are a bunch of options here. I'll just pick this one for now. Once you hit Deploy, you'll land on a page that shows the configuration. Next, you'll see the order summary. If everything looks good, hit Deploy, and then it'll start creating the instance. You'll see it's pulling data and booting up. Logs are visible too if you want to peek under the hood. Once it's running, hit Connect and choose the HTTP option. Or you can start a web terminal too. Now you can play around. In this case, we're using Comfy UI with the Flux model. This is cool, right? Now, what if you want to deploy your own model? Easy. Go back to Explore and click on Create My Template. Give your template a name, drop in the Docker image address, and add your container's start command. Then, set the disk size. Novita gives you 60 gigabytes free, so that's what I'm using here. After that, put in the HTTP port. TCP port is optional, unless you need it. You can also add environment variables if needed, and choose whether to keep it public or private. And the next step, and kind of important one, the README section. It's actually meant to help others understand your template, so make sure to add a clean, clear explanation here. Once you're done, hit Save, pick your GPU instance, and deploy, just like we did earlier. Same flow, just with your own setup this time. So, that's it. Give it a try. Right now, Novita is offering $50 GPU credits to the first 50 people who create a good community template. You just have to follow these instructions. Once done, just share your template on their Discord and you're good to go. You'll also get $5 of free credit to try their platform, so don't miss it. If you found this helpful, give it a like and don't forget to subscribe for more. See you in the next one.